everybody up early this morning I'm at Vulcan's Rest CL campsite it's got five pitches it's in the middle of some fields in Coningsby next to RAF Coningsby it's just got some very basic facilities which is all you need Got a little gangplank here so you can watch the aircraft from RAF Coningsby. We're about 10 minutes away from the first flights, so let's hang around and see what happens. Okay, so here we go up the gangplank, just getting my cameras all set up. See that residence down there. I've got a camera in the corner. facilities here at Vulcan Rest hope you can hear me because the wind's pretty strong as you can see there's this little area here uh, you could probably put your table and chairs here if you've got them bins old-fashioned bins fresh water toilet waste and in there it's just a toilet and as far as I can say you use a thick hose to rinse it out I have done it that way <laughs> yesterday so it's very basic and this is the toilet block so those people who don't have toilets in their vans You've got mirror, a toilet, a bin, some bits and bobs, and a sink. And something growing through there in the tin roof. So I would say that's as basic as it comes, but you know what? Doesn't spoil the enjoyment one bit. Guy here who's sleeping in, a, in his tent above the car. He's gone off. There's a couple here from Yorkshire. They've they've just left for the day. I think they're going to the museum. And there's the gantry, and you can observe the planes. 
the runway runs that way to come up here and then whoosh there's me again in the corner this couple have just gone for a walk a nice hymer there they've been motorhoming for years nice couple very knowledgeable about the aircraft so a quick look around again this is it five pitches can you see the radar tower in the distance for RAF Coningsby and then big man round that's a private building for builders and the track goes down there the Google map van actually went down it but and wonder if you can guess what's in these fields you have no problem making a pan of soup with this lot because you've got rows upon rows upon rows of leaks 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 everywhere that's just one field there's another one well the same one it goes round the corner I don't think as usual a farmer would be too happy if you if you um, went and helped yourself to a few and you can see the dark green there that's the same all leaks so you, now you know where they come from that's the site got the bed tied up of sorts <laughs> and I think it's time for some breakfast okay let's see what's in here oh, um, various bits fruit salad very healthy me you know I'm gonna pack a bacon so I'm gonna do some of that I've got some eggs in there, I might have an egg, we'll see. I may just have a bacon sandwich. Tricky bacon all ready to go into the air fryer. So we'll do that now. That's it, all in. Right, all powered up. About 180. And we'll just 10 minutes it. Bosh. I'm undecided whether I have some eggs with it or oh, I've got a tin of tomatoes I've got the old beans we'll see okay that's the bacon ready that's good enough for me there we go there we go a little bit of daddy sauce in there Yummy in Bosh and Bosh. <laughs> Boil in the bin. Cheers. Mm. Paddy says that will ding dang do for me. <laughs> Just want to put me over the shout. Well, it was forecast okay that was my video from Vulcan Rest 
campsite in Collingsby, which is in Lincolnshire. It's £30 a night. Uh, it sounds a lot, but it's good value, I believe, because you've got access to the planes, watching the planes about 200 metres away. And this morning, for example, um, there was about 15 flights of uh, Typhoon Eurofighters. So if you went to an air show, you pay probably £15 upwards for a ticket and then you get a free, basically a free air show. So I think it's well worth it. Basic facilities, if you're used to having toilet blocks with heated floors and all that, you're not going to get that here. So you've got a toilet and a washroom and you've got fresh water taps. You've got somewhere to drop your waste from your um, toilet. And yeah, it's ideal. Um, and you can have your little motorhome or you can have a camper van and there's a guy there over there with a tent on top of his car and all the guys here and the ladies seem very knowledgeable about the planes and when they're due and stuff so your Monday to Friday is mainly the, the dates that they fly um, if you're coming here it, it is if it's, it's, it seems like it's a bit difficult to find but if you locate it on Google Maps and pin the point that it shows you where the the farm is, not the farm, but the actual entrance on the main road, pin that and drive to that pin. If you watch the start of my video, you'll see exactly how you find the farm. Uh, and I came in from um, Horn Church because I went there to do some shopping, which is about eight miles away. I'm sure the shop's closer, but I went to a Tesco's there and I filled up all my food and stuff. So yeah, thanks for all new subscribers. If you like what you've been seeing, please give us a thumbs up. Comments, don't get many comments. I must be doing something right. Please put your comments on if you feel you need to or ask any questions. And I shall see you on the next video. Oh, just to point out that if you want to book this site, it's on pitchup.com or if you search for um vulcan rest on facebook uh the contact details are on there and the phone number uh the phone number is fine a lady called dawn and you can book direct with her and she'll give you her bank account details and you can pay her direct it's quite safe i'm quite happy with that and she was here yesterday just to make sure everybody was happy um and they were enjoying themselves so yeah good service okay see you soon bye